This is not the first time birds have taken inexplicable actions. In 1963, at Bodega Bay, California, thousands of birds inexplicably descended on the town, attacking its residents. The attack resulted in everything from minor injuries to at least three deaths. The incident of the 60s and the incident of this week are remarkably different from each other by the very nature of the birds involved. At Bodega Bay, many different species of birds terrorized the town, not the least of which were seagulls and crows. The polite thing to do would have been to clean the shells first. Show! Show! Seagulls are thought by many to be nothing more than an annoyance at the beach. while crows, usually thought of as frightening birds, are a staple character in horror films. Unlike gulls and crows, storks are known for their caring and protective character. Portraits are painted of storks on walls of nurseries and on pages of children's books. They're always depicted as gentle and strong animals that are easy to admire. Yet the biggest distinction between these two events goes far beyond how popular culture portrays the birds involved. The striking difference between these two events is the victims. In 63 at Bodega Bay, birds were randomly terrorizing humans who had not aggravated them in any way. Women, men, elders, and children, everyone was attacked. Last week, storks attacked themselves, their client, and their client's investment all in a single action. They were able to kill themselves and the human babies at the same time while simultaneously making a statement to those who placed an order. Exactly what that statement is remains a question to be answered.